Hey, Ray, thanks for joining us on today's video on a pretty rare car. You know, back in the day, people said, oh, a 914 is not really a Porsche. And, uh, well, things have changed. Let me tell you, with the advent of 911s going skyrocket as far as values and things like that, it's drugged these up as well. And the standard 1.8 914, keep in mind they made over 100,000 of these that year, 100,000 of these things uh, over time. And I wanted to just make sure I got the number right, 5597 are the two liters. 5597, which is a ridiculously low number, we're talking about 5% of the total build are these cars here. This is an original black car and uh, it's had a nice decent restoration on it and it's ready to drive. It's got receipts for the engine rebuild and the transmission and the new paint and the new wheels and tires and all of the stuff, yada yada. And it's just a great car. You'll be very surprised, very surprised when you get in it, how comfortable and how roomy it is. For people who are like six feet and up, it's a great fitting car. I'm 6'1", I fit in here with plenty of room. The target top comes off or on, I'm comfortable in there. It makes a great sound out of the sport exhaust. And uh, we're gonna take a walk around. We're gonna look at some cool stuff that's on it. Comes with two sets of wheels and tires. It comes with the stock rims as well. And uh, you can have a decision whether you want us to deliver it with them on or off. And however that works out, that's what we'll do. All right, so I like to talk about paint a lot. And the reason why is because video is what shows us the quality of paint and pictures and things like that. And I buy a lot of cars all over the world. Pictures make up for, uh, make up for some mistakes that I've done in the past. And that's why I spend so much time showing you what real good paint looks like. We, when we painted this car, took all the emblems and, and uh, uh, lenses and all of the, the reflectors and things like that replaced all of those things too so that you start up with a nice clean slate if you want to go to a car show and you pull up in a car show it looks really great if you just want to go downtown and pull up the valet is going to put this car out front and a modern car they're going to drive around side because this is an old school cool car but it drives like a modern car anyway what I want you to do is be able to see how clear the letters are in the paint right and be able to read that all right, so this is a real car. It can be a daily driver. It can go on a long trip if you want to. And I'll show you why it's like that. It's not just a sports car. You say, well, Tone, a 914, is that really considered a sports car? Well, in this case here with the two liter, we got a lot more power. We got four wheel disc brakes. We got four wheel fully independent suspension, right? We got a car that you see many of them at the racetrack, all right? And then on top of it, if you wanted to, this is cool, man. Look at this. This could hold uh, all kinds of soft luggage here. We have a whole nother trunk compartment back there for more if you wanted to. And it's all nicely detailed in here, as well as some modern things that make for cool cars. You know, for instance, like this year's uh, vintage Volkswagen Beetle, right? Didn't have a blower for the fan. It only had levers and it only worked when the car was really moving. Here we have a full HVAC system, right? So it's very modernized, pop-up headlights. It's money well spent on a car, that's, uh, that's considered a sports car and it looks good. So this is all detailed too. If you wanted to go to a car show, you could open this up and show everybody and it looks great. And then uh, some things to look for that are really important. For instance, like the VIN number is still stamped on the inside here. And why is that important? Well, because if the car was in an accident or something like that and pieces had to be replaced, right? Those pieces would no longer be there. And the fact that they're there leads us to believe that this is a nice solid uh, unmolested car from the beginning and that makes a much better driving car. All right, so this is a pretty important shot. These cars are a lot faster than people make them out to be. This is nice because it's got the two liter call outs right here. It's got nice design here. You can see clearly we painted the uh, restored, sorry, replaced all the lenses on the back, restored the bumper. Uh, the Porsche call out on here, that's a US spec thing. Uh, in Europe, the European cars uh, didn't get Porsche across the engine compartment right there. The US cars did. Underneath that engine lid right there is a brand new uh, rebuilt engine by us here. So it's the two liter, uh, all rebuilt and uh, in all nestled in and ready to go. Sounds great, runs great and looks really good. So this is another part I like to talk about. And this is kind of cool because here the target top is stored, right? And because it's so light, all right, it comes right on out, okay? And it still has room inside here, all right? For uh, luggage to go underneath here if you wanted to. Uh, maybe you don't want to put the, take the target top off and you have even more room in here. Uh, it's an amazingly versatile car. And I think that just the fact that it's a sports car and it has all this stuff that you can go away for a weekend is, makes it double duty perfect. All right, so let's take a peek in here. I just wanted you to be able to see the detail of the rebuild. So we painted all the components, obviously, uh, uh, made things nice, took the caps off here of the tops of the air cleaner so you could see the carbs, how clean and detailed they were as well. A new coil, distributor cap, spark plug, spark plug wire, like all that stuff just so that it runs really well. Um, this is the, you know, this is as much as you'd be able to show people. People are going to want to see this, believe it or not, because it is a two liter and the two liter makes it pretty rare. And we did ahead and made sure that we put like the correct emissions decals and stuff like that, just to find a little touches to make it look good. All nestled in there, ready to go. 
All right, so we close up the video here. Let's run down a few of the things we talked about. Fresh paint, show wax and detailed, right, with all new emblems, uh, decals, uh, all the lenses and things like that. Looks great on the car. Uh, the rebuilt engine and all the, the components, exhaust, and all the detailing that went underneath the car. Four-wheel fully independent suspension, four-wheel disc brakes, enormous room inside to go away for the weekend. It's the awesome ultimate sports car when it comes to that. And watch what's happening right now. This is the collectability. What happens is you missed out on a couple other cars that were collectible. Here's a chance to get in on the ground floor watching these cars go up in value and have some investment uh, that you could actually drive. Anyway, call us 301-816-1000. We'll tell you all about it. Don't forget to like us there and uh, make sure you subscribe too. And we're going to go for a test drive and I'll see you in the car.